Yansas Tikali Sarapimo. Hello and welcome to my YouTube channel, everybody. If this is your first time seeing me, my name is Oz and I make reaction videos and some music on the side. Cyprus has finally released its song for Eurovision this year, everybody. We already knew that Cyprus was going to be represented by the gorgeous Andrew Lambrou, and I think the expectations have been quite high lately because Andrew is someone that we kind of like haven't really seen cut it from Cyprus on the agenda of Eurovision. Now this year I think the Euro fans are expecting a little bit more from Cyprus given what happened last year with Andra Mahi. Unfortunately Cyprus's song Ella couldn't make it through to the finals and they couldn't pass the semi-finals which for me was heartbreaking because I loved that song so much. Now this year we have Andrew singing and performing Break a Broken Heart. Now, just from the name of it, I'm expecting to hear something a little bit low tempo, uh, maybe a slow song, maybe a ballad. Um, again, something that we haven't really seen from Cyprus, because I think ever since Freyra, there has been this femme fatale trend going on, which kind, of, which kind of like worked with Cyprus up until one point. So I actually got really excited when I saw Andrew representing Cyprus. Uh, a fresh take, something new, something exciting, uh, and something different. Now, if Andrew has taken care of this song as much as he has taken care of himself, then this song should be good. <laughs> okay, let's do this together, everybody, and then we will have a quick chat. Oh my god, this is so different. <laughs> is this the most western type of song that Cyprus is submitting? Oh! Wow, so different coming from Cyprus. All right, we've got a date scene going on here. Wow. I can see that there has been a lot of work that went into the song. Broken heart. Our new chorus. Take a broken heart. Wow. You can break a broken heart. Oh, they got in a fight. I just feel like the producers must have gotten together and be like, okay, how many things we can put in a song? Let's make it catchy, a little bit up-tempo, a little bit more ballady. So this is, this is everything all at once. I'm loving it. That mixed voice, the falsetto and head voice all together, oh my god. Oh my god, I'm living, I'm living for this song. Wow, I mean Cyprus, this is absolutely refreshing. Seriously, I'm so happy that, you know, Cyprus has taken the risk of submitting something completely contrasting with the past year submissions. I love it. I love the song. I love the genre. I think it kind of like felt everything all at once a little bit for me, but I think for Eurovision this works because because with this song there could be so much that can be done, especially in terms of the staging. I feel like the music video a little bit lackluster. I mean, come on, this song is epic. But all of my Cypriot friends in Cyprus and in Greece and Everywhere, what do you guys think about this song? Are you happy with this huge contrast compared to what we have seen from Cyprus 
up until to this day? Or would you have expected for Cyprus to stay in the lane of ethnical music, do what they've been doing for the last past years? I for once really love the song. I think it really showcases how amazing of a singer he is. Obviously we will know more once this song is performed live by Andrew at the semi-finals or if not at the um, Eurovision parties beforehand. So I am really 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 dying to know what you guys have to think. Once again guys thank you so much for tuning in today and sharing these moments with me. It would make me very happy if you subscribed to my channel and like this video for more content. And I will see you very soon. Mwah.